people pooped out, out outside, and it, you you see them big poo poo piles, and and each one of them them turds had the rest notches on it. The what? Each one of them turds had red rest notches on it. From the corn cob? I mean, it, when it's coming out so hard, they had to stop and rest. <laughs> they had rest notches. Okay, now tell your story about the old days where you're in the outhouse and you had to use a corn cob to wipe your butt. You ain't gonna put that on there. Yeah, do it now. Huh? Do it. Tell them which one you use first. Well, you use a red cob first and then use a white cob to see if you need the red cob again. <laughs> and why do people use corn cobs to wipe their butt? Because they're rough. And they cleaned you better. It, we, <laughs> we didn't have anything but catalogs, and, and they was too slick. Couldn't clean yourself. Uh, they used a cob that cleaned everything off, including the hide. And so, you, you had to squall a little bit. <laughs> so the Sears magazine was too slick. Yeah. And what year? It didn't clean good. What year was this? 198 I think. When was it? 1940s? Yeah, 19? about not, not in, the, not in the 40s. And there was no toilet paper back then? No, we hadn't heard of it. <laughs> we now might buy none anyway, so it didn't matter. <laughs> so y'all were really some hillbillies. Huh? Yeah. Some real hillbillies. <laughs> M Marvin and June was the worst. They come before we did. Oh my God! Their butts were raw when I was born. 